Hey guys, welcome to the Prepping Preacher. Man, I'm Brother Tim. I'm so glad you're here. I hope God is truly blessing you. Hey, uh, everybody's talking about that there isn't ammo. There is ammo. Let me tell you something. There is ammo, and you better go get it. Stay tuned. I said this is the prep and preacher I'm brother Tim man I'm so glad you're here I'm I'm hoping God is truly blessing you hey uh, if it's your first time with us man hit that subscribe button ring that bell that way you'll get all the new videos and we cover a gambit of, of stuff but mainly prepping and uh, ammunition second amendment uh, and I want to thank all those that have, have subscribed and all those that are hitting the likes and the comments uh, man I'm truly blessed with them and I thank you for it but uh, you're helping us get our voice out, and uh, uh, we stand on uh, pro-God, pro-family, pro-life, pro-Second Amendment, that is guns, and uh, pro-these United States of America. And uh, if any of the, one of those offend you, well, then uh, go find you another channel, uh, because that's what this is about. And we're going to keep talking until somebody shuts us down or we go home. Uh, and for you to understand what going home means... Uh, you probably need to hit me with a comment and I'll explain what going home is uh, because uh, I want this isn't my home, man. I'm just passing through. But again, thank you for all of you that have subscribed. Uh, hey, guys, as I'm saying, you need to go get your ammo now. Uh, as the illustrious Joe has said, uh, that we're going to we were going to have a dark uh, winter. I think we're coming up on a dark fall. And a lot of people saying, oh, they'll never shut down. Uh, well, would you have thought two years ago that we'd be going through the stuff we're going through now? Um, I believe half of what I see and none of what they tell me, I can tell when they're lying, their lips are moving. And uh, with all these forced vaccination uh, rules now and forced masking, and, and we've had schools in our area shut down because uh, there had been an outbreak of the China virus. Uh, so I got a feeling we might see another shutdown. Uh, and if we do, uh, as I've been trying to tell you about the food, the economy is not going to recover and there's going to be people hurting for food. Well, the same goes for the ammunition, guys. Uh, it's going to get hurt because you're not going to have people mining uh, and producing the materials it takes to make the, uh, make the uh, ammunition, nor will you have the ammunition manufacturers at full force making the ammunition. So... Uh, it could get hurt. I mean, and as far if you're waiting for prices to be like before they were the China virus, well, good luck with that. Everything is going up. That, that means our dollar is buying less. Uh, that's a whole economics lesson that I can give you. But if you hadn't realized that your dollar is paying less, well, then you hadn't been to the gas station lately. So even like uh, to make the brass for your for the ammunition, it takes copper and zinc. Uh, mostly copper. Well, copper is a lot higher now than it was two, three years ago. Zinc is higher. All all raw materials are higher. And so they're higher. Well, that's getting passed on to us. So you're not going to see it uh, in them prices anymore. I'd love to see uh, 5.56 five, at 20 cents a round again, but I don't think I'll see that. I would love to see $10 boxes of 9 millimeters. I don't think I'm going to see that again. Uh, once they get that price increase, that's it's usually here to stay. But... Uh, the people saying that there's not any ammunition out there, there is. You've got to be diligent. You've got to look for it. Um, I'm going to show you today, and you can see some of the bo the bags here. We're going to go through and see what's there. But I'm going to show you what we picked up in, in, in right at about a week's time, just in run-bys uh, when we were out doing other things, uh, running by stores to see what they had and picking up the, the limit that they give us uh, per person. Uh, picking it up, we were able to stock back a lot that we had shot over the summer. Uh, still need to pick up some more, though, can't they? You know, somebody said, how much ammo is enough? And I said, I hadn't got there yet. So, but uh, I like to train. I like to use my weapons. So, got to have ammunition to do it. Uh, the, I've got the laser stuff, but it's just not as fun. I like to hear them go bang. So, I'm going to show you some videos of these stores, and some of the audio is gone on these because... Music was playing really loud in the store, and what it what that does is that's a copyright violation, and so YouTube would hold it up. Uh, so we're going to... Mosquito, sorry about that. 
we're going to we're going to I'm going to show you and you'll see what's all out there, man. We we're seeing everything. We're seeing the 300 blackouts. We're seeing 300 magnum, seven mags, 243s, 270s, 30 alt six, 22 short, 22 long, 22 magnums. I could go on and on, but the ammunition is getting out there. 44 magnums we saw. Uh, there's all kind the ammo's getting out there and it is a little pricey. Some of it, some of it's not bad. Uh, but you'll see all the different ammo, uh, shotgun shells. I was wondering about that for dove season. Shotgun shells are out there and now Academy's got it 10 boxes uh, per person. So, uh, the way I've seen some people shoot that, they might get a limit on 10 boxes, but I digress. But, uh, check out the stores and then we'll come back and see what we got. I haven't called anybody yet, but you can see all the 22s they've got, 350s, 308s, we got shotgun, 100 round boxes, 243s, two. Okay, let's see what we got. Now here you see the Academy box, bag here, first bag. We got Federal 9mm 124. Two. By the way, this is a shout out to Tools how he does his. 
got number three and number four. There's 200 rounds, guys. Hit the next bag. All right. Got some two two threes, hundred round of two two threes there. All right. Got one oddball box of blazer, hundred and fifteen grain. Now here we go again. Let's see what we got here. Got hundred and fifteen grain federal. All right, these bad boys here we're going for eighteen dollars a box. These right here we're going, you know, they they're eighteen dollars a box. That works out to thirty six cents a round. All right, now we're up to four hundred rounds now we're going over here next box bag excuse me now we got some 115 grains there's one there's two there's three come on there should be another one. oop there's four so now we got 600 rounds wait a minute we're not done i got some remingtons there 100 round box all right wait a minute there's winchester 350s all right, now, told you about them 350s. Now let's see what Walmart had. You saw the Walmart we had there. Man, I'm running out of room on my table. Gonna have to get a bigger table. We got one box. We got two box, 325. These were $18 a box is what these were. All right, got three and four and five. And six. And seven. Wait a minute. And because they had a four round limit, I got a little bit of Winchester there, 22s. So guys, can you see the ammo? There is ammunition out there if you're willing to go look for it and pay what they're, what they're asking. Like I said, 36 cents around here. Under six cents around here. Right at nine cents a round for that bad boy. These were about thirty-six cents a piece. Uh, Fifteen dollars for the uh, for the Winchester three fifties. Uh, we're looking. We were looking at <clears throat> for the for the hundred uh, for the hundred rounds. I was getting it for uh, uh, that was sixty-five dollars a box right there. That's sixty-five cents a round. So guys, the, the the ammunition is out there. Trust me. Well, you saw what it kind of ammunition was out there. You saw what we picked up. Being diligent, using their limits uh, that they preset, whether it be three boxes, four boxes, whatever it may be. But the ammunition's out there. And guys, these times are getting darker. And I'm telling you, if we have another shutdown, you're not going to be able to get any ammunition. Uh, so pick it up when you can. Uh, swing As you're going on your rounds during the day, during the week, uh, that was just one week I showed you, okay, that we picked up. Uh, as you're going around... If, go in and check it out. Walmart, wherever it may be. That was two academies and one Walmart where we racked up on that. And uh, we're put, and they had more. We didn't buy them out, guys. I, and I'm not reselling this stuff. We train with ours, and we like to have it here. We also use it for self-defense. So if you get a chance, go by and check it out and see what you can find and put it up, man, because uh, we don't know what the future holds, but I know who holds the future. Praise God. That's my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Again, if you made it this far, well, God bless you. I appreciate you being here. And uh, always remember, uh, if you've got a prayer request, put it in the comments. We lift you up in prayer. We believe in the power of prayer. But guys, again, get ready, get prepped, buy it cheap and stack it deep, guys. Uh, until I see you again, though, I pray God may richly bless you and that you'll continue to stand in that gap. This is the Prepping Preacher. Guys, I'm out of here.